topic of this video is hands as a calculator. Numbers, sums, and products are abstract facts that cannot be easily associated with visual objects. Consequently, mem memorizing abstract facts is very difficult. The facts in the addition and the multiplication table. The hands represent a readily available visual object that can form a number of sums and products and that fact allows um, a much easier process of memorization to take place using our hands as a calculator. Through repetition of the procedures the facts in the addition and multiplication table will be memorized automatically. When recall fails, the hands are readily available at all times to do the calculation using your hands as the calculator. Hand calculations are superior to pencil and paper arithmetic for one simple reason. The students can practice the procedures at any time and any place. They don't need a pencil and paper. There are 10 basic numbers in our base 10 numeration system. The numbers are 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9. There are 10 basic numbers and we can use one or more of the basic numbers to write any other number. That's, those basic numbers are the only ones that will appear in any number you ever write or any number you ever see. Since we have ten fingers on each, five fingers on each hand or ten, there is a one-to-one -one correspondence between the basic numbers and the fingers. And that fact allows the hands to be used as a calculator. Because 9 is the largest basic number, the largest number in the addition table will be 9 plus 9 or 18. In the multiplication table, 9 times 9 is 81, so that will be the largest number in the multiplication table. Some examples, we we'll use two. I want to add 9 plus 8. Okay. Now, the camera is your eye, and these models are your uh, right hand and your left hand. Okay. So we're going to count, starting with our right hand, we're going to count up to the add in. 8. But since we already have 5 fingers on each hand, we're going to start our count at 6 and we're going to follow the procedure according to the American Sign Language. And it goes like this. This represents 1, that 2, thumb 3, okay? Then for four, I'm going to close the thumb and open those two fingers. That's a four. And then finally five. So the thumb is used for three and five. And we're going to follow that, but we're going to start our count at six. All right. So in the right hand, I'm going to say six, seven, and then extend the thumb, 8. So I have three extended fingers in my left, right hand. In my left hand I want to count up to 9, so it's going to be 6, 7, then the thumb comes out for 8, and then the thumb closes and I lift these two fingers to make 9. Okay? six, seven, eight, nine. 
So I have four extended fingers in my left hand and three in my right hand. Four and three is seven. And that's the ones place. Now the tens place is always going to be a one because the sums that we're interested in, adding two basic numbers that add to a two-digit sum, that sum must be, be, be between 10 and 18. So 9 and 8 are 17. Okay. I would like to um, multiply 9 times 8 using a method called visual nine and that is we're going to start with both hands open all the fingers extended so there it is we start with both hands open and the fingers extended and the multiplier using visual nine is always going to be a nine and the number that we multiply nine by is called the multiplicon and where they're going to designate the numbers, the multiplicons, as this is one. We're going to start out count on the left and go all the way over to the right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I want to multiply by nine times eight. So I'm going to go over to the eighth finger. This is five, six, seven, eight. And I'm going to turn it up facing you. Remember... The camera is your eyes, and these are your hands. Okay. And so you do what I'm doing on the model. All right. This multiplicon 8 separates this into two sets. There are 5, 6, 7 on the left, and there's two extended fingers on the right, to the right of that. So... 9 times 8, this is the tens digit, 7, and the ones digit is 2. So 9 times 8 is 72. All right. In our next clip, we will verify the facts in the addition table.